what it's all about. Manchester United travelled down on Thursday, letting the train take the strain. And they went to see the Jersey boys tonight. Alan, it's Saturday night fever. Well, yeah, I think from Manchester United's point, much. One or two issues in front of him. Danny Alves and Eric Abidal both suspended from that final two years ago. They start with Javier Mascherano in and Carlos Puyel on the bench. In midfield, Sergio Busquets is able to take his place after complaints were dismissed by UEFA about some misbehaviour in the semi-final. 90 contestants in this 56th European Cup final. He'd love to get forward, but will find this fellow Park in his way. Part of the Manchester United plan. And plays on the left with Pedro down here on the right, but uh, they will switch, I think. And Messi has the line. And that's it, comes off Vidic to uh, a the turn. And stand forward by Carrick, the flag is up. Against Fernandez, who was bright as a button again. Substitutes so many candidates. Four midfield men. Here's a Rooney, and Valdez had a problem with Rooney, and also with the positioning as the edge of the penalty area was... Messi working with Villa, and the challenge by Ferdinand. Not might have played back off Villa for a goal kick, but the referee's given a corner. Yeah, to move the legs. He's got uh, Xavi, invited him to play in the cross. And it was the first real opening, and it was Pedro coming in from the opposite flank, first opening for Barcelona. Well, the best moments by far for Barcelona, involved in an attack. We need to shade that possession now very comfortably. Xavi. Now David Villar. Oh, it's kicked on and Edwin van der Sar would love to keep it clean. Villar! A little nick off Ebra, but it was reined in very calmly in the end by van der Sar. Oh, he looks such a threat tonight. David Villar really is. Here's Iniesta and Messi. Is he in here? Wonderful tackle. Waving tackle. And Rooney trying to run away from Mascherano. And now it's Messi and it's problems. It was one on one with Ferdinand, but he couldn't to come and watch that final, but his family wouldn't let him. He's found Pedro! Barcelona score in the 27th minute. Put away by Pedro, who was put in the clear by Xavi. And after that bright Manchester United start, it's a little bit like Rome here. It is, he's just sneaked in behind Ryan Giggs and Michael Carrick Xavi in a way that he had several times in the minutes leading up to this match. It's the only two. We work hard. And this is Rooney. And Rooney has equalised for Manchester United. He struggled in previous finals. He's centre stage now. What a strike from Wayne Rooney. And a big thank you to Ryan Giggs as well. But we wondered about Rooney, could he step up on the grandest of stages? Well, he's just given his answer. Has he drifted offside? Maybe, factually, Ryan Giggs, but he does a great job of controlling it with his... But he does a great job of controlling it with his left. He had the look, Ferguson, there of the man that didn't... Exp the bounce is at the other end. Mascherano. Iniesta... Attackers. And the referee has blown. Tommy's going to kick it in their direction. He goes short to Busquets. Oh, unlucky. Unlucky. Nice, isn't it? Very nice. A little bit too much weight on the attack. The best form of defence. Oh, but Messi skips away. Vidic looks for David Villa. Oh, Messi couldn't quite get the touch to send Barcelona in with a half-time lead. Well, maybe trying to be a little bit too precise if you're going to pick a fault, but there you go, Vidic sucked in, a little nutmeg by Messi, and he's away. Picks the pass, could he have put his foot through it there? Probably would expect more of the same. Expect the game to open up a little bit more as the second half progresses. 
It's been quick, it's been slick, as Alan says, it's been here before, a couple of years ago, they played. And PK coming in. Actually, uh, is in a goal here, good save by Van der Sar, comes out to Messi. Van der Sar was back, but Messi. Oh, Messi! He overpowered Edwin van der Sar. Out of very little, the little man gets a lot for Barcelona. He scores in England, and it's at Wembley. Puts Barcelona 2 1 up against Manchester United in the Champions League final. Not so often, Martin, we eulogise about his mazy dribbles. This time, it was all about the shot, the power. Edwin van der Sar, I'm not sure the ball's swerving away from him. The question he's got, the Dutchman, is how on earth has Messi got the space 20, 25 yards out? To... 53rd goal coming in the 54th minute of this match. Conceded two, the first two away from Old Trafford in their Champions League campaign this season. Well, they came back to watch him in action. The Valencia will have to be careful here. He has been lenient, I think that's his last. He got there as quick as he could, Michael Carrick, but it wasn't quick enough. Well, I think he accepts it. Well, there were 96,000 applications for tickets, officially 25,000. Iniesta. It's Messi again. Parried by Van der Sar, cleared by Nemanja Vidic. It's a lovely ball by Iniesta. It's Dani Alves. Cleared away by Fabio. Xavi has the shot and Van der Sar flies through the air to turn it behind for the corner. Well, right again, a Barcelona player given the top. What a Chelsea at Stamford Bridge. Barcelona have got Manchester United where they want them at the moment. It's David Villa. Brilliant, brilliant Barcelona, David Villa gets in on the act, and that should, it should see off Manchester United, they forced them back, and they found a way through again, Pep Guardiola's, magnificent through again, Pep Guardiola's, fantastic play, with the ball, without the ball too. 1-1 at half-time, has become free. Xavi, trying to go through himself rather than return it to Messi, who's not here. To Kassai, the referee is just letting Barcelona break. And Giggs was convinced. It was in the same part of the pitch as Patrice Evers in the first match, really. After the first ten minutes, they park. And this is Hernandez, and uh, as he had to do once in the first half, Victor Valdez. But here's Nani, skipping Abidal. Still Nani, that's why. That's what he's on for, get the ball. Came into this match, what was it, one goal in 14, David Villa? One in 16. Niesta. That's it, oh, and he's... That was... Really happy on the islands tonight. It would be just like them to supply it. Poised for their celebrations, which start now. And Wembley is hallowed ground for Barcelona again. See a scorer. Via a scorer in the second half as they pulled away from Manchester United. And Sir Alex accepts it with good grace. He knows that they've been beaten by the best in Europe in the new stadium. As Barcelona were the best in Europe in the old stadium 19 years ago. Guardiola a winner here as a coach, just as he was as a player. No revenge for Rome for Manchester United, none of their joy of 1968. It's Barcelona's fourth triumph, their third in the last six years. Well, it was a pleasure to be here, as much as I was hoping Manchester United could lift the trophy. 
you have to hold your hands up to what is one of the best sides I've ever seen in my life, Martin. If you want a 10th play, the hand.